Hello, welcome to Ludic Science. In this video, I will make these high voltage capacitors that you can use for several high voltage projects such as Tesla coil, voltage multipliers, etc. These capacitors are around 1.6 nanofarads and you can use them with up to 10,000 volts DC. However, they can also be used for AC since these capacitors are not polarized. These are the materials. We need a couple of transparencies. This material withstands around 10 kilovolts, so it's good for high voltage capacitors. Also, we need some copper tape and a bit of wire for the capacitors terminals. Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. Cut your transparencies in half and then apply the copper tape. You need to leave around one centimeter from the border and on the other side you need to leave an extra piece of tape in order to make the connection of the terminal. You will get something like this. Now take the two parts, put them like this with the wires at the ends and roll them together. Put some tape to avoid unrolling and your capacitor is ready. Let's check the capacitance. It is 1672 picofarads or around 1.7 nanofarads. Now let's apply high voltage to the capacitor using my homemade high voltage power supply around 8 to 10 kilovolts. Now the capacitor is connected in parallel with the output of the high voltage power supply. Okay, the capacitor worked without problems. It can withstand the 10 kilovolts from the high voltage power supply. So there it is, a simple way to make capacitors for your high voltage projects. You can use in place of the copper tape, aluminum tape, or even a kitchen aluminum. However, you cannot solder the terminals if you use aluminium, so you will need to use another method like tape or something. However, it will also work okay. Aluminium is also a very good conductor just as copper. So, 
I hope you liked this video. Thanks for visiting my channel and see you in the next one.